was a gloomy old day, wasn't it, with pockets of drizzle about. But we did see some sunshine on the eastern side of Scotland. At Aberdeen, the temperature reaching about 12 degrees and plenty of sunshine all day through East Anglia and the southeast. But paradoxically, here, some of the lowest temperatures today. We've got a change in air pass, of course. That's responsible for the higher temperatures. Another change now coming into the north of Scotland with some more persistent rain and drizzle now showing up. But the winds are going to be pretty light throughout tonight and tomorrow, so not too much wind at all to clear the cloud away. Very calm conditions indeed for the next 24 hours. So further rain and drizzle to come in northern and western parts of Britain tonight. Some more persistent rain now moving southwards with clearer weather following to the northern half of Scotland by the morning. And you can see it's going to stay pretty clear in the southeastern corner here, so some freezing fog patches are on the cards and again a fairly general frost. Temperatures down to minus two degrees in some inland parts, staying above freezing around the coast, but elsewhere generally a mild night, six to eight degrees, but turning chilly again in the north of Scotland behind the rain band later on. Well, not too many isobars on the chart for tomorrow as far as the British Isles are concerned, so we've seen the light winds already. But this system here, winding itself up, will take wind and rain into the north of Scotland after dark on Friday. For many places then, a very dull and damp and drizzly start, extensive fog over the higher ground, but already some brighter weather into the north of Scotland. Some breaks in the cloud, giving some sunshine on the eastern side of the higher ground, and some sunshine in the south and east here outside of the foggy areas. During the day, we'll find it gradually brightening up in other northern and eastern parts of the country. Also, some of this sunnier weather moving us a bit further west as well across the South Midlands and other southern counties of England. Northern Ireland may well brighten up for a short time before the rain arrives later on. Temperatures very much the same as today, about 11 or 12 degrees over Scotland, but nearer 8 degrees in the sunnier parts of East Anglia and the southeast. Well, that cold front moving south over the weekend, but hesitating through East Anglia and the southeast during Sunday, a little ripple may run along that to give some more persistent rain during the day. For Saturday morning, still some fog in the south, a rather chilly start. Elsewhere, outbreaks of quite heavy rain across Scotland and Northern Ireland, with brighter weather following to Northern Britain during the day. But then on Sunday, most of the rain in the south, whereas for central and northern parts of the country, it's a mixture of sunshine and rather wintry showers. Bye-bye.